Hi there, young explorers. I'm Liam, your guide on today's number safari adventure. We're going on a wild journey through the jungle to meet animal friends and learn all about numbers one through 10. Can you help me count and spell along the way? Grab your safari hats, let's begin. Look over there. It's our first animal friend on the safari, one elephant. Let's count together, one. Now we have two tall giraffes, one, two. Here come three playful monkeys, one, two, three. Look at four striped zebras. One, two, three, four. Wow, five mighty lions. One, two, three, four, five. I see six colorful birds flying in the sky. Count along. One, two, three, four, five, six. There are seven happy hippos splashing in the water. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. Here are eight slow turtles. One, two, th three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Look at nine beautiful butterflies. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. And finally, 10 huge rhinos. Count with me one last time. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. 10. Wonderful counting explorers. You have learned about numbers one through 10. Now our animal friends want to teach us how to write numbers as words with a special number word song. Let's sing along. Monkeys in a tree. Number four is F O U R, that spells four. Four zebras trot the floor. Number five is F I V E, that spells five. Five lions come alive. Number words, number words, let's learn how to spell. Number words, number words, we'll learn them so well. Number six is S I X, that spells six. Six birds do flying tricks. Number seven is S E V E N. That spells seven. Seven hippos big as heaven. Number eight is E I G H T. That spells of eight. Eight turtles. Isn't that great? Number nine is N I N E. That spells nine. Nine butterflies so fine. Number ten. Our animal friends are getting hungry after all this counting. As safari guides, we need to pack the right quantity of animal food. Let's make sure each animal gets exactly what they need. Look, five hungry monkeys are waiting for their bananas. But I see eight bananas here. That's too many. We need to remove some bananas so each monkey gets exactly one. Let's count how many bananas we have now. One, two, three, four, five. Perfect. Five bananas for our five monkeys. 
one banana for each monkey. Now our seven elephants need peanuts for their snack, but I only see four peanuts. That's not enough. We need to add more peanuts so each elephant gets one. Let's count all of our peanuts now. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. Excellent. Seven peanuts for our seven hungry elephants. Here are nine beautiful birds waiting for their seeds. Let's count the seeds to make sure each bird gets one. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. We have nine seeds. That's perfect. One seed for each of our nine birds. Finally, here are two cuddly pandas looking for bamboo to munch on. But I see six bamboo stalks. That's too many. We need to remove some bamboo so each panda gets the right amount. Let's count the bamboo stalks now. One, two, perfect. Two bamboo stalks for our two pandas. One bamboo stalk for each panda. You're amazing at packing the right amount of food for our animal friends. Now they can all enjoy their perfect meal. This shows how important numbers are when we need to match things up correctly. Our animals are happy and full because you counted so well. Let's play a super fun game of number hopscotch with our bouncy friend Kangaroo. Now let's give Kangaroo a hopping challenge. She's standing on number two and she wants to hop forward three times. Let's count her hops and see where she lands. Starting at two, hop into three. That's one hop. Hop into four. That's two hops. Hop into five. That's three hops. Kangaroo started at two. And after three hops, she landed on number five. Great hopping and great counting. Time for a backward hopping adventure. Kangaroo is standing on number eight. She's going to hop backward three times. Let's count together and see where she lands. Starting at eight, hopping back to seven, that's one hop. Hopping back to six, that's two hops. Hopping back to five, that's three hops. Kangaroo started at eight, and after three hops backward, she landed on number five. Well done, Kangaroo. And great backward counting. Okay, Safari Explorers, here comes Kangaroo's biggest hop challenge yet. She's standing on number 10, and she's going to hop backward nine times all the way to number one. Are you ready to count with her? Starting at 10, hopping back to nine. That's one hop, back to eight, two hops, back to seven, three hops, back to six, four hops, back to five, five hops, back to four, six hops, back to three, seven hops, back to two, eight hops, and back to one. That's nine hops. Ooh. Kangaroo hopped all the way from 10 to 1 with 9 great big hops. That's some awesome backward counting. Congratulations, explorers! You've completed our number safari adventure. Today you learned how to count and recognize numbers 1 through 10, write numbers as words, match numbers with the right number of objects, and count forward and backward on a number hopscotch. You're now a number safari expert. Keep practicing your number skills at home by counting toys, books, or anything around you. Maybe you can count how many steps it takes to walk from your bedroom to the kitchen. Thank you for joining our Number Safari adventure. Until next time, keep counting and exploring the wonderful world of numbers.